get ready for the dictation start mr deputy speaker sir i would like to thank you for giving me this opportunity to participate on the rajiv gandhi national institute of youth development bill 2011 i am also very grateful and privileged to the congress president and our chief whip for giving me a chance to express my views on this very important bill which depicts the future of the youths of this great nation sir as we all know that youth is the backbone of our country in all sense be it in the way of development be it in the way of information technology or be it in the mobile sector in fact our late prime minister sri rajiv gandhi was convinced that the future of india lies in the technological modernization as well as in the maintenance of agriculture he introduced the technology mission during that period in fact his cherished dream was to take india into the 21st century free of poverty and exploitation his ambition for diversified rules in computers and also decentralization of the panchayati raj are some very important factors where we can remember him by being the fighting force behind the indian system of administration in fact sri rajiv gandhi had the confidence in the youth that is why he gave empowerment to the youth by making the voting age from 21 years to 18 years now coming back to the bill i would like to inform the house that like our very renowned and experienced speaker who himself is a cricketer stated we had very good in interaction with the honorable sports minister while giving reference to the youth who is the backbone of the country we have 50 crores of youth but it is true that we may not be having so many institutions i would also agree with you that there is a lot of brain drain but we have institutions like the academy for scientific and innovative research which is a part of the csir where children are being groomed and they are being given preference and facilities where children could be educated especially in the fields of medicine and other sciences but in this case i would like to contradict with the honorable minister this is the system where we are trying to get the youth involved not only in studies but also in co curricular activities like sports the process that has been adopted in this bill shows that this bill is of a very important nature particularly when we can see that the advisor is the president of india itself this shows how much importance the government is giving to it to make it an institution of national importance this shows that the government of india and the ministry of youth affairs are taking deep cognizance of it i have not much to say on this bill which has been introduced here by the honorable minister i really really think that this institute which has come up should not confine itself only to tamil nadu we have to take up issues of the backward classes including the women folk 
वी हैव टू गिव इम्पॉर्टेंस टू अदर एरियाज स्पेशली इन द नॉर्थ ईस्ट और प्लेसेज लाइक छत्तीसगढ़ और उड़ीसा बिहार वेस्ट बंगाल वेयर द यूथ आर बींग मिस गाइडेड एंड हैव टेकन द रोंग ट्रैक दिस काइंड ऑफ इंस्टीट्यूट एंड दियर ब्रांचेज शुड स्प्रेड आउट थ्रू आउट द कंट्री आई एम रिक्वेस्टिंग द ऑनरेबल मिनिस्टर ऑफ स्पोर्ट्स एंड यूथ अफेयर्स दैट दिस काइंड ऑफ इंस्टीट्यूशंस शुड रियली बी इस्टेब्लिश्ड इन ऑल पार्ट्स ऑफ द कंट्री लाइक आर लर्नड फ्रेंड हैज सेड वन इंस्टीट्यूट कैन नॉट रिमूव ऑल द वॉइसेज ऑफ द यूथ थ्रू आउट द कंट्री सर द ऑनरेबल मेम्बर फ्राम द अदर साइड मैंसनड अबाउट सम इशूज विच हैव बीन रेज इन द स्टैंडिंग कमेटी ही स्पेशली मैंसनड अबाउट द मैंटोर ग्रुप एंड ऑल्सो अबाउट क्लॉजेज सिक्स एंड सेवन ऑफ द बिल द ऑनरेबल मिनिस्टर हैज सेड दैट दे हैव ऑलरेडी बीन कवर्ड एंड सुटेबल अमेंडमेंट्स हैव बीन प्रपोज द स्टैंडिंग कमेटी एडवाइज अबाउट कंपोजिशन ऑफ एन अकेडमिक काउंसिल एंड अ फाइनेंस कमेटी दे हैव ऑल्सो बीन इंक्लूडेड इन द बिल इट इज स्टेटेड इन द बिल दैट द एनुअल रिपोर्ट एंड द ऑडिटेड अकाउंट्स ऑफ द इंस्टीट्यूट शैल बी लेड ऑन द टेबल ऑफ बोथ द हाउसेज ऑफ पार्लियामेंट आई थिंक इट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट बिकॉज दिस इंस्टीट्यूट हैज़ टू बी गिवेन इट्स ड्यू ऑनर एंड रिगार्ड विच इट डिजर्व्स फ्रॉम द नॉर्थ ईस्ट वी आर रियली वेरी ग्रेटफुल टू द फेमिली ऑफ लेट श्री राजीव गांधी एंड सेटिंग अप अ नेशनल इंस्टीट्यूट इन हिज नेम इज अ वेरी बिग अचीवमेंट फॉर ऑल ऑफ अस आई होप द एंटायर हाउस कमेंट्स दिस बिल होल हार्टेडली with the amendments which have been proposed by the honorable minister with these words i conclude my speech and hope that it will soon find a place in the institute book sir finally i once again thank you for having given me this opportunity to participate in this important debate it has caught the attention of all sections of the house and the people including the media as it is closely related with the aspirations of the youths stop